I can't believe it. The commissioner of the police shaking my hand. <laughs> you know, I could really get used to this whole hero thing. Hey, is the food all right? You're not eating. You're not still shook up, are you? Karen. What? Uh, Ricky, you know what? I'm sorry I made you miss your cake. What, are you kidding me? The guys in the band are totally loving this publicity. We might even get a, a gig in New York out of it. Besides, what's important is that, that you're okay, right? Oh, <laughs> there he is, the hero. Jim, uh, Jim, uh, kiss the ring. Ah, kiss no, what's going on? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, I heard about everything that went uh, down over there. You sure you okay? Yeah, thanks. Hey, have a beer on me, all right? I'll be right back. Wow. Sit you down. Change, man. Don't touch my food. So, um, I'm glad everything turned out the way it did. Yeah, me too. Yeah, all sorts of crazy stuff happening in that park. That shadow thing? Yeah. Yeah, crazy dude. Same story. Black Hood, no one sees his face. Some people say there isn't a face. There wasn't. Just swoops in and out, saving anybody in trouble like he's some kind of comic book hero or something. Just... Wait, what'd you say? Are you saying you saw him? No face. I don't know where. One minute he's there. He attacked the guy that grabbed my bag. That shadow thing is what saved me. What? Ricky. The shadow thing saved you? You mind telling me why I didn't know about this? Jack, come on! This isn't funny! Uh, it's, the door is probably locked. Yeah, I know it is. I told you. Wait a minute, what's going on? You don't seem that upset. Well, who said that I was? Jack did. He said you were practically losing it, that you might even hurt yourself, and that was all a lie, wasn't it? That, that, that's great, that's nice. Come on, Jack! I think he's gone. You know, I, I've heard all these things about you, that you're supposed to be this nice girl, so th this, this is really beneath you. What are you talking about? The tricks, the lies, all that, you know? Oh, right, yeah, that's me. Yeah. I'm deceiving you and, and cheating you and, and setting you up. That's me. What am I supposed to think, huh? Why don't you try thinking it off? What? You heard what I said. False pretenses, feelings that would actually make you do things you wouldn't normally do. Does any of that sound familiar What is to it? You, what Ray? kind of games are you playing? I'm not Ray? playing games. I don't do that. You must have me confused with your wife. So what do you say to this, Allison, huh? Nothing stronger than family and nothing, nothing means more to Rafe. Right, Mom? <laughs> Mommy? God. Wow, I never thought it happened so soon. I'm not ready. But I will be. I will be. The time's right. The guy's right. Once I get pregnant, I'll be mine for good. Father and husband, and there won't be a thing she can do. Mine forever. Wow. Come on, Rafe. You've been gone for God I don't know how long. My clock is ticking and I have to get pregnant. It has to be tonight, Libby, okay? So this here thing was all a bunch of crap. Ricky, the, the commendations, the slap on the back, all of it. What a chump I was to believe that I saved the day. But you did. Yeah, right. I came in and cleaned up after the shadow thing took off. Uh, does it really matter who did what? Yeah, yeah, it does. All right, come on. So Karen, why don't you tell us what really happened, huh? 
he was there, okay, before you showed up. It, it just all happened so fast that that guy grabbed my medical bag, and then all of a sudden, it that shadow came out of nowhere, and, and then it was all over. Just like that? I don't know what he did or, or, or how he did it or what happened. Next thing I know, the guy's 20 feet away, and it just stood there. That shadow, no face, no eyes, just black. And it just stood there waiting until you showed up. And then it just disappeared. And that's when I ran in and saved the day. Stop it. What were you thinking, Karen? Huh? What were you thinking? Were you thinking that I needed the crowd to slap me on the back or yes. what? What? Yes, I did. That's exactly what I thought. Hey, baby. Welcome back. You missed me? Because I sure miss... No. God, Livy, no. It's that's too obvious. He's not going to buy that. All right, now about this one. Mm. Hi, Ray, funny. I must have fallen asleep, so why don't you come over and warm me up? Because I've been waiting. And waiting, and, and waiting, and... How could you be so dumb? Dare her! What is it gonna take? Rape isn't yours, Allison. He's not a part of your life. He's my husband. Calm down, Libby. Calm down. Okay. Just think. Think, think. If you were her, which you're not, but if you were, you wanted to take him away and drag him down memory lane until he was brainwashed into your arms, where would you take him? Think. Think, think. God, yes. Yes, of course, that's it. Let's just leave Libby out of this. Oh, believe me, I would love to. But since she's so good at leading you around by the nose, I can't. Leading who, by, by the way? The nose. It, I chose it because it was polite. Oh. Good. Okay. So, what is this place, anyway? This is my grandmother's attic. I brought you here once to talk to you. You didn't know. And... I've never been here before. I, I have no memory of whatever it is I'm feeling right now. But you do feel something, right? Something. What's going on here? Why am I here? Why'd, why'd you bring me here? I wanted to talk to you. The whole locking you in part of that was Jack's idea. I'm just as surprised about that as you are. And for the record, I'm not planning on killing myself over you or anybody else, but I really do believe that you are being played for a fool. Libby's my wife. I know she's your wife. Great. I know that. But she's also feeding you with a bunch of lies, and I think Deep down inside, you really know it's true. Just the same way you know you didn't just wander into my hospital room and kiss me awake. No, Allison. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, there's Livy. She's conveniently pregnant at the same time. And, and common sense, it flies right out the window? Okay, okay look. I am looking. Look, you... I am, I am. That's the difference between you and me. What I see is I see things with my eyes open. You should maybe try that because the view from here is amazing. Okay. Okay, fine. Maybe I'm looking in the wrong place, so help me out. Fine. For whatever it's worth, this is what I think. Libby, she's not pregnant. But she is very desperate, and she's willing to say and do anything to make sure that you don't leave her. And just the same how you know how to put your pants on every day, you should be able to look past what you, what you don't know, and you can't see and pay attention okay, to what you do wait. feel. And would you slow down for a minute? Know, if you, you slow down it, for a minute, and yet you I'll won't let you. yourself. Let you're just making you. yourself so mad because you won't pay attention. Okay, what's going that on. is it. When are you going to stop being such a doofus? If huh? you do that, doofus. Yeah, doofus. That's what I called you. Did you just call me? I called you. A, a yeah, that's, yeah. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> You 
really thought that I needed to feel like a hero? Can you please let me explain? Well, guess what, Karen? It didn't work. I mean, I must have looked like the biggest idiot, making it like I was some big-time superhero, more like big-time super mouth. Um, Jamal, kiss the ring. You don't swear, Hey, why don't you right? let the big hero get you another beer, huh? Okay, cut it out. Thanks a lot for letting me in on the truth about what happened at the park. Dude, I was just talking. No, 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 no. You know what? As always, good old Ricky was just a little late on the scene. Okay, maybe you didn't stop that creep from grabbing my bag, but you did stop that black shrouded creature. Stop them. Karen, I didn't even see him. Well, the minute you showed up, he split. I mean, there's no telling what he would have done if you weren't looking for me. I don't know. Maybe he would have uh, flown you home and made you a nice gourmet meal, complete with a $200 bottle of champagne. Oh, come on. And then okay, he that's enough. Just, just back off. You stop, you're sounding crazy now. Just no, stop. No, 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 just no. stop. No, I was sounding crazy before. Dude, you should have heard me, man. I mean, talking to the cops, explaining how I saved my, my, my lady friend here, and you. You just let me shoot my mouth off, and you just let me you just you, keep you just going. stop? Sometimes it's hard to stop you, Ricky, like right now. All right, Jamal, then what would you have done, huh? Come on, tell me. Well, maybe he would have let his lady friend here explain instead of acting like some little spoiled brat who goes around beating everyone up because somebody stole his lollipop. Spoiled brat? with me when I know Allison I should have known she would have pulled something like this come on Rafe I need to talk to you but not on the phone come to our special place well, guess what Allison it's our special place I married him oh okay all right <laughs> you probably put that there too huh so I'd fall over it if I came after you which I am Guess what, Allison? You can't stop me because rape is my husband, and you can. I'll do anything. To change it. Huh. Well, if you think for one minute you can sneak up and take the man away from me that I... All right, all right, you. Look, I heard you, I know someone's there. Come on, show yourself. Stop playing games, hello? All right, have it your own way, whoever you are, but if you think I'm afraid, I'm not. I'm not afraid. <laughs> Sorry. So, <laughs> I'm a doofus, huh? Yes, you are the biggest kind. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm just an everyday fool. You know, I know that you want a family. I know that's really important to you because we used to talk about it all the time. And once upon a time, I actually asked you to Give me a child. You wait. I I just. I know I don't you don't. I know it's okay. You don't have to say anything. Me. I. It was actually a little selfish of me. Why? Well, it's selfish. Why? Because I, I knew that you couldn't stay, and I knew what we had. It wouldn't last because of it. But I, I wanted something to stay while you were gone. I'm actually a little embarrassed about it now that I think back. Well, why? What? Because I, I just wanted a reminder of you and what we felt for each other. I wanted to know that it was really real. But really what mattered was how much we felt for each other, which was a lot. And I knew that in my lifetime, I would never love anyone half as much as I loved you. Wow, I just... I just really wanted to give you that. I wanted to be a part of that with you. I wanted that. I wanted that. You know what? No, I'm sorry. I can't. I don't want to. It's not. I can't. I'm done. I'm just done. I want to go. This is a bad idea. Somebody, please. I just want to leave. Please just get me out of here. 
can't believe you just said that to me. Ricky. That's how you really think of but, me, but Karen? Stop. I didn't mean to come here and stir things up between yeah, you well, guys. Yeah, well, guess right? what, Jamal? It's okay, Jamal. Look, hey, hey, you want some advice, bro? No. Well, here it is anyway. Get over yourself. Come on. Would you, uh, calm down? Fine, Karen. You want me to calm down? Calm, I. You really think of me as, as what? Someone who's, who, who's down on himself? Fragile? That I need the whole world slapping me on the back to feel good about who I am? I saw you, Ricky. I saw how excited you were, how you felt when, when the nurses, our friends, the police, everyone we met on the street made you feel like a hero. I knew from the way you reacted that it was probably the first time something like this has ever happened for you. So forgive me, but I didn't want to take that away. I know from my own life what it means and how important it is to feel special. You make me feel so... Loved. I loved seeing that look in your eyes. It's a thing you deserve to feel every day because you are special. I just wanted the world to see what I see. Please believe that, Ricky. Jamal, you really stepped in it this time. Jamal Woods. Yeah, that's me. Who wants to know? Oh, you are back. Back? Casey, what's up? Answer me or leave me alone. Stay away. Keep away. I swear to... I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Somebody, please. Jack, will you let uh, me I out? I tried Aaron? that already. You're just going to lose done. your voice. Hello? Well, it's not like I really mean anything to you right now anyways, no, so... that's not true. Well, you can't even remember, so really what... You're so what? I still care! You care? Look at me! I know how I feel. Okay, maybe, maybe I don't know why, but, but so what? You know, I'll figure out the reasons later. Or, or maybe not. Sometimes we never know why we feel the way we do. The heart knows. Yes. Sometimes if we listen to that heart, then... Yes. So then, you may or may not know why you feel something for, for me, but, but you do. That's right, yes. So then you admit it. Yes. I feel something for you. Okay? I care. I do. I do. But that doesn't change anything. I, yes, I, I feel something, but it, it, could, it could be just a friendship. I mean, a really deep friendship sometimes, but friends can feel more. And I'm a married man. Prove it to me. Prove what? Kiss me. Kiss? Listen, kiss me. Just one time. Kiss me. And if all you feel is friendship and it's meaningless, then I promise you, I will never bother you or Livy ever again. Just kiss me one time. tell me that you feel nothing, that there's nothing else there, because I really don't think so. I think that maybe there's, there's some... Who are you? What do you want? Stay away from me. Please don't touch me. Don't touch me. No! Stay tuned for scenes from the next Port Charles. Torn. 
export Charles. You look so much like this oh, girl. Wait, no, don't tell you. me, Casey. And there's this guy that I know who is going to freak when he sees you. You love me and you want me. You can feel so much that it hurts. Just a minute. 